Good morning, Graham School. Hello, my name is Nikita. And my name is Arush. Today is Friday, March 17th, 2023. Happy St. Patrick's Day. What, that's today? That's right, today is St. Patrick's Day, the holiday originating in Ireland that celebrates St. Patrick and the Irish cultural heritage. Oh yeah, hope you wore green today. Due to trash being left on the turf and track during lunch yesterday, the turf and track will be closed today during lunch. Ms. Feng and Ms. Nishihara would like to announce the winners of the Random Acts of Kindness Challenge. We definitely felt more kindness throughout the campus these past few weeks. Let's keep it going for the rest of the year. The following people chose to do a kind act for someone at Graham, such as saying good morning to 15 people or our school itself, such as picking up 10 pieces of trash and they turned in their RAK green sheets. Thank you for spreading all kindness. The winners are Ming S. from in sixth grade from Ms. McCollum's first grade class, Ugan B. in sixth grade from Ms. Lee's first grade class, Devika S. in sixth grade from Frau Diddy's class, Annie K. sixth grade from Ms. Tuffy's class, Santiago L. Period, grade, sixth grade from Ms. Kanna's class, Lauren G. from seventh grade in, Ms. Le in Mr. Lang's class, and Ms. Tuffy. Please go to the office now during break, lunch, or after school to claim your Target gift card. Now for scheduling information. Monday, you will have a spring picture day. This is an optional photo day, but if you want to get your pictures taken and give your parents a chance to get a picture, look good on Monday for picture day. Teachers, please make sure to take roll now. Club news. The clubs for Friday are as follows. Lunch clubs. Ultimate Frisbee will be playing out on the field with Mr. Mulkey. The film club will be meeting with Mr. Butler in room 5. After school clubs. The dance team will be meeting in the sports pavilion with Miss Mueller. Have fun. Sports update. March Madness began this week with the championship set to be played on April 3rd. Yesterday, Duke, Alabama, Maryland, San Diego, Missouri, Texas, Auburn, Northwestern, Arkansas, and Kansas all advanced. Additionally, Furman and Princeton advanced in major upset victories to seemingly superior teams Arizona and Virginia. There are no school sports, to, there are no school sports games or practices today. Going to announce the new art contest theme. It is due April 30th at 11:59 p.m. The new theme is spring. You can represent it in any way that you want. Be as creative as you can. We'll be judging based on originality, creativity, artistic skill, and theme representation. Drawings will be disqualified if they are plagiarized. If you are unsure if your drawing is appropriate, feel f for the art contest. Feel free to email mzites1 at mvwsd.net for about any questions. To submit your artwork, attach it to the same email. We look forward, if you want, also give a short description of your artwork in the email. We look forward to seeing your spring drawings. Anyways, here are your awesome acts for the week. First is Juliet R. from Miss McCollum for Together We Can and Take Pride. Juliet was super helpful for the art show, art one show all three days. Next is Trishala C. from Miss Tuffy for Together We Can. Trishala and her group were demonstrating model collaborative work on their annotations. Then there's Harvey T. from Miss Vang for Do No Harm and Together We Can. Harvey did the right thing looking out for another student's well-being, acting kindly and with responsibility. Additionally is Charisma R from Ms. Pabson for I Belong, Pursue Knowledge, and Together We Can. Charisma is always doing her best work in science class. Next is Lucy B from Ms. Smith for Take Pride. Lucy shows an amazing work ethic and has created an incredible butterfly sculpture that is above and beyond requirements. 
Last but not least is Angel C from Miss Wildfewer for Take Pride. Angel did a great job focusing on his LPAC speaking test. He paid attention and persevered. Good, good work, Angel. You guys are awesome. Winners, make sure to pick up your prizes in the library. On a more serious note, today is the first year anniversary of Andre's death. Andre was a Graham student last year, and he died in a bike accident. Now we have a message from Mr. Noriega. Today we are remembering Andre, a student that we lost last year. We will never forget him, and we think of him every day. We will now take a moment of silence to remember him. Thank you. As we all process and continue to process uh, the loss, if you need to speak with a counselor, Ms. Vang and Ms. Nishihara are both available. Thank you. After our sign off, we will end with a video in memorial to Andre. That is all we have for you today. This, this was brought to you live by GMS TV. Now make the most of every moment you have with people. Here's a video honoring Andre.